So I've been ozonating this chicken for about two minutes now. Um, they're just frozen chicken breasts. I dethawed and then I threw them into the water and then put the ozone machine, ozone stone in there. And this is what's coming up. So don't know if it's from the plastic, from the methods that they use to freeze the chicken. I have no idea. But these are the contaminants that you would typically be ingesting all kind of bubbling up to the top. So I'll scrape that off, throw it away obviously, and then I'll ozone them one more time in completely clean water. But uh, it's important to clean your meat, it's important to clean your foods and your vegetables, very, very important. And I just wanted to show you this little tidbit. Thank you. And here it is about 10 minutes into ozonating the chicken. Just wanted to show you what it grew into. <laughs> so. You can see, again, it's important to clean your food. So this is 10 minutes of ozonating two chicken breasts, two frozen chicken breasts. The contaminants off the top of this water for the chicken. So you can just take a little spatula like this and just clean it off. See, again, if that's coming from the plastics or the freezing method, I have no idea. But I know it's disgusting and I know I don't want it in my body. Look how it's, it's even attached to the hose here. So I'm going to clean this all off like this and then I'm going to put some fresh water in and just ozonate it for just a couple minutes just to make sure everything's clear but I'm just getting it all off there. Just wanted to show you how to do it. So here I just put the fresh water in and again I'm going to just um, ozone it for another minute or two by the way when you do it this way your chicken is juicier because it's infused with oxygen and it cooks faster so just be ready for that it cooks a lot faster so uh, just kind of the methods of cleaning your meat before you eat it and there's it's a little there's a little bit of it but it's not bad the majority of the nastiness is gone as you can see so happy about that but again this is cleaning your chicken with your ozone machine um, and you're just purifying it that's all you're doing so it's a it's a healthy way to clean your meats uh, with no man-made chemicals used okay thank you thing great thing about the ozone machine if you want to sterilize everything including the core just put it put some fresh water in there I'm sterilizing this. This is what I used to scrape it off. And I'm sterilizing the hose and the stone. So great way to sterilize anything that's been contaminated because we know that ozone is one of the most powerful sterilizers known to man. So just easy ways to help you. Um, not too many steps, but keeps everything clean. Thank you. Another easy way to clean your hose and stone after you've had it in meats like uh, chicken or anything with salmonella in it, you can just simply put water in the glass and then stuff your hose in there and your stone in there and it'll clean it. So it's another easy way to do it.